Hey, what's going on guys? I'm just doing a quick video here on my review on this Extreme Tech keyboard uh, from Five Below. Um, that's where it's at. I'm not sure if they have uh, another company or something else that sells out of there, but I got this at Five Below. I'm not sure if it's a Five Below brand or anything, but got it from there and I was skeptical about it because I only paid five bucks. And <clears throat> I was, for one, I really don't like wireless keyboards at all um, I prefer wired I think the response time is a little bit better on a wired keyboard so that's just my opinion um, but when you open the box you get, <clears throat> you get this little thing here now you put that in the back of your computer and <clears throat> it's battery operated it's not charged so you can't just charge it it takes um, <clears throat> two AAA batteries you just pop those in there and <clears throat> it pretty much starts right away uh, the only thing is, um, when you first turn, plug it in, um, put the batteries in, you get a, like a little orange light here. It's pretty much a battery reader. I guess it turns orange when the uh, batteries are low or about to die. Uh, fairly, it's a pretty decent keyboard. It's uh, very flimsy. It's uh, <clears throat> not sturdy, but like I said, fairly decent. And the response time is really good. I really didn't have any issues with it once in a while. I had uh, maybe like a second or two delay or it didn't work right away or respond right away. Uh, but that's only happened a handful of times, like I said, it's only temporarily. So if you're on a budget and you just need something, like if your keyboard just broke and you have no other option, if you have a five below nearby, I definitely recommend just go you know, go pick it up and grab it. Um, but um, the only thing I don't like about it is when you hit the caps lock, you can't tell when the cap lock is on because there's no light or anything to indicate that and this light here is only just to tell you when the battery is like going to die or when you turn your num lock on you don't know when this is on here at all like other uh, keyboards you have light here or up here or somewhere you know when it's on or off same thing with the num lock um but like I said other than that it's fairly good I only recommend it as a last resort if you need something right away. But other than that, I think it's a fairly decent keyboard. And this is going to be pretty much raw footage, y'all. I'm not uh, going to edit or anything. I'm just going to upload and go as is and keep it real as possible, straight as possible. Um, but like I said, it's fairly decent. <clears throat> you got all your keys that you need. Um, your escape. And you can pretty much hear it. It's 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 all right. It's, they don't have a um, things to, um, stand foot stands to, to raise it up a little bit either. So it's just pretty much like flat all the time. You can't raise it up or anything. So no, 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 no. I think I don't like about it. But my review, if I could give it, uh, like out of five stars, I would probably give it maybe like a uh, two and a half. I wouldn't give it a, a full uh, four, five, or three, but uh, two and a half, I, th I think it's very fair, especially for the great quality and uh, well, not great quality, but for the decent quality of it, uh, it holds up. I've been using it for about two weeks, and so far, no issues besides the little wire ones I missed. But um, I'm gonna be doing a lot more reviews, a lot better reviews, especially in different angles and better angles, and with a better camera. But this is just something I wanted to get out there real quick because, uh, like I said, I had this keyboard for a while. I've been wanting to do a video of it. Um, I just really haven't had time, so I'm just doing a quick video real quick just to give you all guys my thoughts and opinions on it. Um, <clears throat> so if you got a 5 below nearby and you need a keyboard like right away and you can't wait to get a decent one or you don't have the money for it or you have a budget, run a 5 below. They have them. Grab it. And it works fairly, fairly decent. But thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you guys for watching. I'm Dago FBA, and this is my review on the Extreme Tech keyboard. You guys have a good one. Good night. God bless.